Hello friends, I want to discuss a commercial move I am making with Trade Predictor. So first there is a statement that I'm going to make and the statement is that the price for Trade Predictor will remain stable until at least May 22nd. Uh, at May 22nd I might change the price or I might not but until that point it is going to stay exactly what it is right now and right now it is $4 for a report for one file. $7 for a report for two files, and $13 for the executable, which has unlimited use. If you are bought the executable, you can use it with however many files you want. So one file is going to be four bucks, two files is going to be seven bucks. How to buy the reports? You can buy the reports on my uh, website. On my website, there is an upload file form, which you will find. It's not very difficult to find. And you fill out the form and you submit your uh, files, the files that you're using. There's going to be two files if you're, if you're paying seven bucks or one file if you're paying four dollars. You submit however many files you are submitting and you submit a proof of payment, which is basically you send me uh, a screen from PayPal that says that you donated or you sent this amount of money to Andrei Harchinka at duskycomputer at gmail.com. That is my credentials on PayPal and I will reach out to you in a couple of days. Um, it depends on how often I will check this uh, this folder. If I have people buying, I will be checking it quite often. So you will you will get your uh, results quite quickly. Most likely, most likely. It's not gonna, you're not going to be waiting weeks to get your results. I can promise you that. Um, now to find the website, the link to the website will be in the description of the video and it is also on, on the description of my YouTube channel about me page. So if you open my YouTube channel and you look at the about me page, you will find the link to this website, to my Megagenix website in the description of my about me page on YouTube as well. Moving on, how and when you should buy the executable. If you have an unlimited number of files you'd like to run through Trade Predictor, or if you'd like to receive updates, which happen multiple times a week, or if you are using Windows operating system, or if your computer has sufficient processing power to run Trade Predictor. If those four criteria you meet, then you should probably buy the executable instead of buying the reports. However, if you are saying, uh, if you are on Mac OS, for example, you cannot use the executable. So in that case, yes, in that case, you should buy the report. Um, or if, you're, if you don't have a computer, if you're an Android uh, or an iPhone user, in that case, once again, you should buy the um, you should buy the report to get the trade predictor executable. You can get it on my itch store, and the link to this itch store is in literally every single video that I make. Uh, the link to the itch store, uh, the link to the itch page for trade predictor will also be in the description of this video. Once again, if you want to buy the executable, you can get the executable from the description of the video. There's going to be a link there. You should be able to access it from the description of this video as well. What you can expect with Trade Predictor, number one, uh, you can expect the best phenotype predictor of all that currently exists. There is no tool online that does phenotype prediction better than Trade Predictor. There is, there is no tool. There is nothing online that is better than this. Uh, number two, the number two thing you can expect is that it's going to be a solid Trade Predictor and health report. Your trades, your responses to drugs, everything and anything you can imagine, it is going to contain that. Ancestry files will show the highest accuracy and most relevant content. Uh, so if you took an Ancestry DNA, if you have an Ancestry DNA file, you will probably have a little bit more content in your results than if you have 23andMe or MyHeritage. Uh, and third is that it offers you a mediocre ethnicity estimate. The ethnicity estimate here is really not so good, um, but it sort of does its job. It's not that bad. It's not that bad either. It's not inaccurate. It's just kind of, it's just kind of really mediocre. It will be better with Ancestry files, I should note that, because Ancestry files tend to get much more SNPs, and it will be worse for my Heritage files. So if you, if you have a my Heritage file, you're going to have much less accurate results uh, for the ethnicity estimate than if you have an Ancestry file. 23 andme files are intermediate, they're about 400 to 550 SNPs, but um, the, ancestry, the ethnicity estimate is not the strong point of trade predictor, and ethnicity estimate is something you can get for free. You can go on GED match. And you can get yourself a uh, very good calculator, which is Eurogenes K36. You can get yourself your ethnicity estimate for free from GED Match. You don't really need to pay for that, but 
it, it was more of a practice with coding for me to make that tool and to incorporate that into trade predictor. It was more of a practice to code for me rather than, uh, you know, to actually make a ethnic calculator. Now, who am I? And uh, some facts about me because maybe this is the first video you see from me and you don't really watch my channel so what am i uh, my name is andrei harchenka i was born in the city of ishkarala in russia uh, it's located basically right next to tatarstan so if you know where tatarstan is ishkarala is like right next to it uh, i was born in may 2003 so i'm turning 21 in a couple months two months i'm turning 21 uh, i was a florida resident since 2014 so since 2014, I've been living in the United States, in Florida, and I have been an Indiana resident since 2023. Uh, I've also been a United States citizen since 2023. So in 2023, I got my citizenship. I am a United States citizen. Uh, I was in college for electrical engineering in 2021. But what's interesting about my passions and what's interesting about the way I approach my life is that this channel completely changed what I wanted to do in life. Because back in high school, I was doing enrolled in college. I was taking all of these really advanced math classes like calculus, DFQ, linear algebra. I was doing really good as well, but but I wasn't really interested that much in, in the math and physics and all that was not so interesting to me. I just did it because I had to. But then I started this channel and I realized that there's something I really have a passion for. And it's, it's this, it's this genetics, it's this bioinformatics stuff, uh, history. This is what I like. So, uh, in 2021, I quit college. I had a health re um, health concern uh, that didn't allow me to go to college. And in 2022, I re-enrolled. But this time, I re-enrolled as a computer science student. And the reason I re-enrolled for computer science is because I wanted to do precisely what I'm doing right now. Uh, the reason I re-enrolled for computer science is basically because I wanted to do what I am currently doing. So, I'm I'm doing pretty good in terms of... Uh, in terms of life goals, I'm exactly where I want to be. And I am expected to graduate, uh, get my bachelor's in spring 2025. Uh, what I hope to accomplish with my project here, uh, with my channel and with all my online activity, what I hope to accomplish with this is, number one, I hope to develop Trade Predictor into the best and cheapest service for health and trades. Once again, every day, basically, every couple of days, I make updates and you will find that on my H page. Basically, every couple of days, there's a new version. And um, do I, rec I recommend that if you bought my trade predictor, you do, you do uh, stay on top of those updates because I will be updating very, very frequently. My second goal is to grow on YouTube and eventually earn enough money to support myself financially. I hope that most of the money I will make will be from YouTube. That's kind of my idea. My ideal scenario is where I make more from YouTube than I do from sales. And currently, that's kind of the opposite. Currently, I'm earning maybe five or maybe even six times more from sales than I do from YouTube revenue. And that's really unfortunate. I would like to earn a lot more from YouTube revenue. <laughs> and third is I would like to build a library of ancient human and non-human genomes. Currently, my library, which I do have, contains 505 different samples. Uh, check it out. It's on my site. And there are still thousands more to come. There will be much more samples in the future. Uh, I don't plan on quitting what I'm doing anytime soon. Uh, you will see videos every day for years on this channel. So <laughs> uh, eventually I'll get to all of them. And four, eventually I want to join a larger bioinformatics team and research the genetics of drug response, uh, what kind of drugs work for some people and what kind of drugs don't. Uh, for some people, some people may have adverse effects to certain medicines. And I would like to research the genetics of that to prevent these adverse effects in some people. I think it's a very noble cause. That's what I'm interested in most. Unfortunately, I don't really get to do that right now because I don't have access to all this data. Uh, I don't work with any research team. I'm on my own and I would like to be a part of some larger research team uh, for sure. And number five I would like to do is I would like to make, uh, make a name for myself, both on YouTube and in the professional field. I would like... Uh, you know, everybody wants to be proud of something. Everybody wants to be like showing to their kids that, hey, I did something really amazing. And that's what I want to do. I want to leave a lasting impression on the world. Well, that's pretty much all there is. All I want to say in this video, uh, make sure you get my trade predictor and 
in case you have a Mac or in case you uh, previously were not able to use it, go ahead and send me your file and I will uh, run it through Trade Predictor for you and give you your result.